What's up Crow Squad? Make sure to subscribe, like and click the ring bell. What's going on guys? It's Crowlando here and welcome to another one of my Clash of Clans videos. As you can see I'm wearing limited edition Crowlando merch. You can't buy anywhere. This was like one of my tester t-shirts. Really comfy actually. That I made back in the day. So yeah, if you're looking for some merch, go check it out. Link in the description below. You can just browse or whatever. You can just check out some of the merch. I've got loads of merch. <laughs> so yeah, go check that out. Also, don't forget to subscribe and like this video. I'm now on, um, I think I'm like 40 or 30 subscribers away from 8,000 guys. So that's sick. So yeah, we should hit 8,000 by Saturday. So yeah, I'm so stoked for that. Um, yeah, so let's get into this new scenery and that I'll do like a description and every, I'll just explain all of it. So yeah, here we go. So as you can see guys, I'm still level 155. Um, oh, let's that down. Woo! See me a bit more now. Um, I've got the Archer Queen to level 50 max and the Barbarian King has got four days left and that'll be level 50 max for... Um, ah! Get the wrong button. What am I doing, man? <laughs> For um, Town Hall 11, and then what level am I upgrading? Grand Warden is currently level 15, so I've got another five levels. So it's up, it's got four days left to go, which will put it up to 16. Then I've got four more um, levels to go, and then I can get it to max because max level is level 20. Um, I have got some league shop points I've saved up over the last like three Clan War leagues, so I can buy one Hammer of Heroes. Okay, so if we check out the shop, we've got Prepare for Battle, New Warrior King from 999. We've got the Hulk Mountain Scenery and we've got Lunar New Year Special. I'm going to be getting all three of these, but in three separate videos. So yeah, we're going to start with the Hulk Mountain Scenery, then move on to the King and then get this limited edition exclusive decor because obviously I need all the perks. Because <laughs> if you look at my Barb King, he's actually got the Champion King skin on, which was limited edition. Um, and I've just moved him. If you look at my uh, Archer Queen, she's got the Warrior Queen skin on, which is limited edition. So yeah, I'll be having all the limited edition stuff. Okay, so current, we've currently got the winter scenery on, as you can see. If we go to uh, the town hall, you can see I've got epic winter scenery, pirate scenery, clashy constructs, and the classic. So the classic's actually in winter. Where is? Let's just select classic a minute. Oh, it's just snowing on the classic. Okay, let's go back to epic winter scenery, like teleports us there. There we go, it's on. Right, so if we go to the shop, you can see they've got this hog mountain scenery on offer. Um, it's a brand new village background, $6.99. I don't know what it would be in dollars um, or for your currency from whatever country you're watching this video from. Um, but you also get two and a half million gold and two and a half million elixir. Um, it's got a description here, I'll just read it out. The Hog Mountain scenery is here. Celebrate Lunar New Year with the all new custom village background. Woo! <laughs> After purchase, select the whole. Oh, it... oh my god. Now, how does Alexa even go off? Alexa! Shut up! <laughs> I didn't even mention it. It's, it's listening to me. Okay, so um, if we click here, it gives you a quick preview of what it's going to look like. Right, let's do this. Fighting. Right, let's scan my fingerprint. Here we go. Processing, processing, processing. <laughs> oh, I've got seven play points also. Okay, oh my god. I just saw the Wi-Fi signal then. It gives me um, anxiety when I see that. Right, okay. We've got the new Hog Mountain scenery. If we go to the shop, that has now disappeared. Oh. <laughs> no, I do not want to buy that right now. <laughs> um, and there's just the three left. I won't be getting that triple aid because that's just nothing. Don't need it. I've actually still got um, a rune of Elixir and a rune of um, Dark Elixir as well. So, yeah, we've just gone up another two million. We can upgrade stuff, but I've got no space. Oh, five hours and 43 minutes we can. Right, we're babbling on. Let's go change the scenery. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four, five. Let's go on a hog mountain. Select. Right, it's just been added. It's still snowing on snow, uh, snow mountain. <laughs> hog mountain, which is cool. My phone's just vibrating because I'm getting notifications. Right, where should we start? Let's start in the bottom as usual. Okay, so as you can see, we've got this new cliff edge. 
it's kind of like the White Cliffs of Dover. Um, there's a pathway going along the side here. There's our boat to go to the other village. Woo! Um, Builders Hall, if we go back, uh, there seems to be like um, this walkway here and a little dock. Um, some steps going up, up the hillside there. If we go over here, there's a little drop down to a what looks like a water. It kind of looks like a fort, like a castle would have, but it's just like a cliff edge still, it's just dropped down a bit, a bit of snow on there. It's also another dock and if you we slightly look to the left it looks like a fish market because there's fish in these baskets, stuff like that and places to pull up to, that's pretty cool. Uh, if we head off around this right side we've got like a mountain on this corner here with a bit of trees and snow then there's another cut out to the actual um, like sea or whatever you'd call it. Um, it's quite dark here, but yeah, there's another steps down from the cliff. It's quite high up. It's like raised the base really high up. I wonder if it's like that all the way around. But yeah, there's some steps going down to another dock. Um, it's got this like Shanghai feel. <laughs> um, there's a little pathway. Well, there's a couple pathways coming off the map here. And then you can go up some stone steps into three buildings. There's also a little stool, which looks like vegetables for sale. They've got bananas and what well, looks like apples and um, stuff like that. Um, there's also a little square here with some nice uh, lanterns. I love lanterns, it's so cool, especially in Minecraft. Um, yeah, there's a nice little courtyard there. And they've got baby dragon statues, which is awesome. Uh, can't really see much more apart from a few trees and then there's another market stall here with what looks like lemons and apples and other stuff then there's a massive drop off on this back edge here it looks like it just goes off and forever and then you've just got I think that's a new Barb King is it? Warrior King? Warrior King? I don't know looks a bit different it's got like a Mohican unless it's like a hog rider um, yeah, you've got two of those statues with this nice gate, uh, gate with um, that what archway of lanterns, and there's this cool bridge over the abyss um, to this massive building, and that's actually really cool because if you look on this other side as well, it's just perched on a mountain. This big building doorway there, it's got some lanterns, the lights are on. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. And then you've just got some tiles here. Be carrying on along. Oh, I've got so much stuff to remove, but I've got no builders. There's this mountain and trees around the top. Some hut, well, some really high mountains. Um, on yeah, it's just resembling China, but there's some high mountains all dotted around. Um, we've got a pathway coming off here, and then a load of pathways disappear off the map. And that's it, guys. Been all the way around. It's cool. It's a cool feel because if you zoom out. The left side mountains look really good and it, it just looks really looks really raised up if you go south. It looks like you're on you're playing on some sort of table. <laughs> but yeah, I, I like it. I like the snow as well. The snow has a good feel. So if you haven't already, please subscribe. Also tell your friends to subscribe. We've got to get to that 10k guys. Once we get to 8,000 on Saturday, which I'm predicting, we will have um, 2,000 more. I don't know why that took me three seconds to work out, but we'll have 2,000 more. And then we'll be on 10,000, guys. 10,000. Can't believe it. I've been playing Clash of Clans. Um, well, I've been doing, I don't know when I started Clash of Clans, but I've been doing YouTube again since 2015. I actually started YouTube in 2006, but I've been doing YouTube since 2015 um, with Supercell Games. Uh, but I've been on YouTube since it pretty much started. <laughs> But um, yeah, to hit nearly 8,000 is amazing. Like, I'm not out there for the money or the subscribers. It, I, I mostly do this as a hobby, so yeah, it's, it's mad love to you all. <laughs> so yeah, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Also, don't forget to check me out on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. See you guys.